Cheers. What's cooking, guys? This is Coach Cass, InspireMoney.com. I just wanted to share with you what's on the stove. So today, I'm cooking chicken carbonara. What you can do is use wheat pasta. And so right now, we have some pasta boiling up here. And the name of this pasta is farfalli. Okay, that we have some green peppers cooking up here. We have the chicken breast that's just sitting and marinating for a little bit on the board. And then we're gonna cook, cut up some more veggies. So I'll be right back. As you can see, I use a totally different chopping board for the veggies. Very important, different chopping boards. That's how we prevent salmonella, guys. Masters of Public Health, foodborne illness talking to you here. Don't play with it. turkey bacon, cut it up on the cutting board, wash hands. So my question is, have you ever started cooking and gotten really hungry, you just want to eat the food and you don't want to wait until it's done, so you start nibbling on random stuff and then you're full by the time the, cook, the food is cooked? I'm really fighting that urge. Now what's really important is that you use two different utensils for your pasta and your meat, okay? Once again, you don't want to get a running belly tonight. You hear me? All right. So that's my trini. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I love food. If you wanted to know the weight of my heart, feed me good food. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> All right. This stuff looks like it's coming to a close. So I'll be with you in a second. Why did I just find my apron? Here I am, all decked out, and the food's practically done. But, hey. Got it now, right? So this is the official cooking show with Coach Cass. All right, so we're gonna combine the meat with the pasta. I can't hold. Once again, to make this meal healthier, you can make sure to include lots of veggies and uh, a side salad and um, what else? A side salad and um, wheat pasta light alfredo sauce essentially alfredo sauce is something you should have one every, once every blue moon lunar eclipse if you know what i'm saying there's lots of saturated fat in it but guess what i have a strong craving so this is what i'm gonna do and i can afford to do that healthy 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 mm, mm, mm. i'm excited <laughs> all right guys i'm done ready to eat so just really quick yeah Chicken carbonara with a side salad with uh, cranberries and walnuts with a light raspberry vinaigrette. Mm. I'm ready to eat. Peace. Coach Cass, InspireMini.com. Bye. Oh, one more thing. Make sure when you cook, when you put things in the containers, use glass containers, right? And then also um, let it sit out for like two hours or until the temperature of the food reaches 70 degrees. Because what happens when you put hot food into a cold fridge it heats up the rest of the fridge and the rest of the, your groceries can go bad or spoil a lot quicker all right that's enough bye i need someone to come and wash these dishes this is not like on tv where the dishes just evaporate somehow i really need someone to go wash these dishes i'll pay you in food is that a knock at my door let me go answer it. <laughs>